Lads and ladies, uh, like uh, lads and ladies of Mallow who are used to supporting the red and blue jersey of Thoman Park, proceed to Rosslair and go down to the ferry and hand in your tickets to Donnerill Park. <laughs> but do not proceed till the custom man lets you. Then straight to the restaurant for joint of the day. It's <laughs> about nine in the morning, so head to the bar and drink ale and porter until start of play. For rambling, for roving, for rugby and sporting, for drinking speckled hen as fast as you'll fill. In all your days roving, you'll find none so sporting as the monster supporter, the bold Sonny Glynn. <laughs> in the year 94, Sonny returned from London. To help the bowl, Brendan, who'd botched up his neck. <laughs> Must have been easy to leave all behind him. But without looking back, he said, what the heck? He built Brenna a house for himself and his missus. And Sonny and Brendan started having the crack. Going on tours following Munster all over the nation. To Wales and to France and to London and back. Far rambling for Roman, for rugby and sport, and for drinking speckled hen as fast as you'll fill. In all your days, Roman, you'll think spineless so sporting, as the monster supporter, the bold Sonny Glynn. As the years they pushed on and Sonny got older, t'was obvious he needed to set himself down. T'was feckin' amazing that, that such fortune befell him. The day that he bumped into Claude Ahern, <laughs> she said her hair was so scraggy and that she looked manky, <laughs> and that she couldn't believe that she looked so fat. <laughs> The rest of the world knew that she was a lasher. And Sonny took one look and said, lads, that's that. For drinking speckled hen, that's that's that. that's that. that's that. In all your days, Roman, you'll find no support. As the monster supporter, the bounce, Sonny, did. Now Sonny is 15. He's getting... Now Sonny is 50 and he's getting so cranky. Let's sing and let's drink and let laughter abound. He's one brilliant singer and one super daddy. But don't be caught telling him that it is his round. <laughs> you are one lucky feather to have such a family. With Connor and Sam you have two super boys. They're gifted at rugby and hurling and football. With a, wife, with a wife as fit as Claude, that is no surprise. <laughs> for rambling, for roving, for rugby and sporting, for drinking, smoking, as fast as you fill. In all your days roving, you'll find them so sporting, as the monster supporter, the